Sammy Baby Doll, I cannot begin to tell you how proud I am of the person that you have become and the tremendous growth that you have shown over the last six years as a young woman, an athlete, and a student. I have enjoyed this time more than you will ever possibly know, and I'm going to miss this more than you possibly could realize. You are my heart and soul, and I love you. I'm proud of you, of the adversity that you have overcome, and how hard you have worked to get to where you are. Mommy's winging this, so now I'm gonna let Jeffrey talk. Sammy, congrats on your senior year, finishing up a high school career. Uh, it all started with local rec leagues, then long trips, late nights in the gym, on the shooting machine, uh, far off tournaments and hotels, waking up to you smother me with a pillow. <laughs> and then obviously these uh, the recent memories and experiences you've shared here with the, the Dixie. We're gonna miss all of them, but more than anything, cherish every one of those moments. So uh, sad that uh, we're closing this chapter and uh, looking forward to uh, what you have next in store. Love you, Sam. Love you, baby doll. Watching your basketball career come to an end surely was difficult, but I kept reminding myself, don't cry because it's over, smile because it happened. So my advice to you is to keep smiling, girl. You appropriately had the nickname Smiley during summer softball for several years. You truly enjoy sports and it shows through that beautiful smile of yours. Keep on bringing your positive energy and effort to your teams and great things are bound to happen. Thanks for the opportunity to be one of your biggest fans and congratulations on a remarkable basketball career. Love you, Mom. Ella, there simply aren't words to express how grateful I am to have shared the gym with you for the past six years, creating so many amazing memories. You had the work ethic of a champion and a heart of gold, both of which are the foundation of the person you are today. I've loved every second watching you grow, leading with compassion and unselfishness, and doing what is best for your team always. From a coach's perspective, it was simple. You were coachable, you did the right things in the right way, and it helped you and our team. From a dad's perspective, you've given me a lifetime of happiness and I am beyond blessed. And I'm still in awe of how you approach the game and how you helped me grow along the way. As you begin your next chapter, continue just to be you. Do your best to help those around you be their best. And I can't wait to see what's next. And so you know, 
You have officially surpassed Michael Jordan as my all-time favorite basketball player. Ella, I love you, and I thank you again for making this an experience of a lifetime and a dream come true.